Now, keeping our focus back on the Pulwama attacks and one of the fallouts that we've seen. Now, post the Pulwama attack, remember we had seen hundreds of people turn up for army's recruitment rallies. Now, one of them turned out to be a suspected terrorist and was arrested with two grenades and a detonator at the recruitment rally in Suran Court in Poonch district in Jammu and Kashmir. Hundreds of youth uh, had been lining up for recruitment in army when a man identified as uh, Ranjit uh, Rajinder, in fact, Rajinder Singh, is what you're told, who was moving under suspicious circumstances and was stopped by the army for checking. During his frisking, two grenades and a detonator was recovered from his possession. Now, the accused has been handed over to the police for further investigation and police said an FIR has been registered and they're investigating all angles in this case. This was the recruitment rally and during the frisking, लड़के थे उनको भी फ्रिस्किंग चल रही थी तो इसकी फ्रिस्किंग के दौरान इसमें इससे इसके पास से हमें एक ट्रेनिंग ग्रेनेड C90 ग्रेनेड उसको बोलते हैं वो मिला है एक UBGL ग्रेनेड मिला है और एक डेटोनेटर जो है वो इसके हिरासत में से हमें मिला है तो अब इसको फार फर्दर क्वेश्चनिंग के लिए पुलिस स्टेशन सुरुन कोर्ट में लिया गया है यहां पे एफआईआर जो है वो रजिस्टर हुई है और फर्दर जो इन्वेस्टिगेशन है वो इसकी चल रही है Nazir Masoodi, my colleague, joining us for more at this point. Uh, Nazir, just wanted to understand one thing. So, Rajinder Singh holding two hand grenades and a detonator actually turned up at that rally for recruitment. Is that correct? Or he was just hanging around there and he was up to some mischief? Well, uh, police has not actually so far shown and given the clear details what was his motive. They were saying he was also coming for the recruitment rally. But if he was coming, why he was coming with two grenades and the detonator? And what police sources are telling us, a major tragedy has been averted. Because hundreds of youth had actually lined up to join territorial army in Surankot area of Pool district in Jammu and Kashmir. It is believed to be it is a militancy-free area. Someone coming there with two grenades and then caught in under suspicious circumstances. It was by chance. They suspected him. And finally, the army actually caught him. And they recovered two hand grenades, and he was handed over to police. And police are saying they are investigating. So far, they are not telling us whether he has any links with militants or any other group. What was the motive? But a major tragedy has been averted because it happened just days after Jammu grenade attack, where a juvenile threw a grenade at busy bus stand in Jammu, which killed two innocent people and more than 30 were injured. That caused huge panic. And just a few days after this incident, a man. Rajinder Singh with two hand grenades caught at an army's recruitment rally where hundreds of youth had come to join the recruitment rally. A police are saying they're investigating and FIR has been lodged. We're waiting for police to say what were the links and what was the motive of this man with grenades at army recruitment rally. Nasir, you say two uh, hand grenades and a detonator. How powerful do you think this could have been? It would have been disastrous. You can uh, imagine when there was a grenade was lobbed at at uh, uh, bus stand in Jammu, two people were killed and more than 30 were injured. Right. Despite the fact that the uh, you know uh, that that grenade exploded beneath the bus, that actually mm. prevented the, its its impact. That actually, uh, so it could have been a really disaster. That could have led to so many casualties because it was a busy place. Hundreds of youth actually had thronged that recruitment rally, and many lives would have been lost. Fortunately, army actually notices this suspicious movement and they caught him, uh, the alert army Jawans, and he was handed over to the police. Police are saying they're investigating the case.